Juliet Naluja, commonly known as Julie Mutesa Asira, is a gospel artist who has also composed some love songs. She went to Buganda Road Primary School before attending three different schools for her secondary level, amongst them St. Balikudembe Mitala Maria, Kitante, and Wampe Ontake. She is married to Pastor Stephen Mutesasira of Redeemed of the Lord Evangelistic Church in Kamocha, Kampala, and a proud mother of three. We wanted in Namirembe Cathedral. Why? Because my parents said we're not getting born again. My kid is not getting born again in a, you know, kind of church. They call them the local churches. So we went to Bishop Sekade. He's my grandfather. So we wanted in Namirembe Cathedral. <laughs> She started singing way back in 2005 in a church choir, though her breakthrough song was a love song, Echikunyumira. The song that brought me on scene was Echikunyumira, which Henry Nance wrote for me. I think it was 2009, I, I think so, yes. And then also in the gospel scene that brought me on scene was uh, Rana Nabo, the one I sang. And then, yes, from there, I, I just didn't go back by the grace of God. She is not happy with born-again Christians who say she is not a character of a pastor's wife because of the hairstyle and wearing trousers. Things I do and people think that I'm not a pastor's wife for the way I dress. In most cases I'm in trousers, I cut my hair, uh, I'm, I'm my life, you know. She denies stealing Samali Matovu's Omkwano Gunyuma song tunes for her Echikunyumira song, saying the songs are different, though the writer is the same. Well, the writer is the same person, but if you hear the relics, they're not the same. They're not the same, really. The writer is the same, the producer is the same, and we're still friends with Samali. There is no, there is nothing. Only that it was the news that used to write, you know, a lot of stuff. <laughs> She advises the youth to trust in God in everything they do. Uh, the youth of today, uh, in this world we're in, you have to put God first in, in everything that you do. You just have to put God first, be it you're doing what kind of job, when you wake up in the morning, just put God first in everything because we need God in everything, like we need God. But in Akatonda there is nothing like you can, you can achieve 